What is escrow? It can be a, a, a very daunting or, or complicated thing. We're gonna simplify this for you to where you can explain it to your friend or your dog. Let's do this. Escrow, okay. Everyone's heard the term, we throw it around. Not very many people really understand it. So here it is from a real estate agent's point of view. Escrow is the period of time from when you get an accepted offer to when you close escrow. Offer acceptance is when it's in contract and you're moving through the sales process, inspection, appraisal, deposit of earnest money at the title company. The title company is a neutral third party. And then you order your appraisal. The appraiser works for the bank. They're like a referee in the boxing match. They don't care about either side of the transaction. They're just making sure that the house is worth what you're paying for it and that there's no health and safety issues in the house. You're about to close. So you're gonna sign at the title company typically a day or two before you actually close and closing is when you get your keys. A couple things to note. You always need to see your settlement statement before you go to the title company. That's the piece of paper that shows the purchase price and all the charges and credits to you and that's your bottom line. That's your down payment or cash to close. So one thing to note on that is make sure it's a cashier's check or a wire. A personal check can take up to 10 days to clear and that won't cut it. A couple things you need to make sure you bring is a valid unexpired form of identification. If it's an expired driver's license, that's not gonna work for the notary to stamp that deed and make the house yours. Funny story, it's the day of close, timelines are super tight, the seller is sick of dealing with us and wants to put the house back on the market. The buyer comes to the signing table at the title company with an expired driver's license. What that means is that's not a valid form of ID. If we don't sign today, we lose the deal. Luckily, mom was in town. She rifled through uh, her stuff and found his passport that was a valid form of ID. She shot down the title company and saved the day. So make sure you bring a valid form of identification to the closing table or you could be in trouble. And at that point, we fund. And then typically a day or two after you sign papers at the title company, you get your keys. And that is what escrow is.